All right, fam, so I'm at 35 Talcottville Road, Vernon, Connecticut, at Jefferson Fry Company, man. I done seen some of the foods that came up out of here. Folks have been bum rushing this pie ever since I pulled up over here. So something must be good in the hood over here at Jefferson Fry Company. Let's go check it out. Mm. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, man, go ahead and get your order on, bro. Fam, I ain't even gonna hold you. I'm looking at the fries. They got wild fries as the base with crazy toppings. You know, the Greek, the twisting. I didn't even bring enough stomach for all this. You know what I'm saying? I left extra stomach at home. I got baseline stomach. Um, but the, uh, so the twisted fries, uh -huh. it's got gravy, bacon, our garlic aioli, scallions, banana peppers, and tomatoes. Okay. Did you get it? We have uh, this diced bacon that's like deep fried. So. It's amazing. Quick shout out to all my glizzy goblins out there. Now, just to let you know, we're talking about soft bun action. I like that lightly toasted. Let's get that little bite of delight. See what this thing hitting on. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. Is that a spicy dog? Is that a spicy beef dog? Ooh, it's spicy, baby. Not only the spicy sauce, you have a nice crisp of the onion. Raw breath action on that one. That sauce has a nice little spicy kick, a little spicy creamy sauce to it, but I'm really believing, just like you get like spicy kielbasa, they might have found themselves a spicy beef on that dog. Great flavor, amazing little snap. Oh, with a soft bun. That really works. The spiciness isn't really subtle at all, but when was the last time you had steak and cheese french fries? So we got the steak diced up. We have our peppers, as you can see, right up over there. You see how cheesy it is? Boom. But keep digging a little bit deeper because you really want to get to the French fry game. You really want to attack that potato. Ooh, looking like some wild ribeye meat. And anytime you get really crazy and then you have the wild ribeye meat, anytime you put anything over French fries, it does kind of actually break the fry down so the fry isn't as crisp. So now you're really talking about, ooh, the potato flex more than a crispy French fry because the potato is actually good. And then now we're just really talking dinner at the end of the day because we got steak. And then when you have the cheese all melted all over it, and then with the peppers that are providing a nice little pop, that fresh vegetable, back of somebody's garden flavor, fresh to pick, that thing turns it all the way up. Mmm. Wow, yo, I gotta get back at the steak and cheese. I was supposed to move on to the next thing. Steak and cheese got a hold on your boy. I don't know what it is, but it got a hold on your boy. Mm. I'll be the peppers, yo. All right, take a snack and looking good. A nice size little tender up off in there. Let's see if we got a little kick because it almost resembles the setup for the husky dog but yet with chicken, so let's check it out. Mm. Damn. All right. Mm. So, the tender is wild crispy. Decent on the meat flair, meat serving size to bun ratio, soft bun activity. The onions, so pronounced, really shine through on this one. Nice little uh, zesty sauce. Again, great for a cohesive type of flavor for this one. Chicken snacker is gonna hold you down when you're hungry in town, baby. Over to the biggest monster burger that I've had in quite a while. This is the monstrous J burger with the J fries up on there with bacon, with two, not one, I right? Two patties of beef and cheese. Crunchy water, red ring of death, all the activity. I'm leaving I'm leaving that on there, y'all. Just for you guys. I'm leaving it on there. I'm gonna make it happen. I don't even know what I'm about to get myself into, but this is a, a real French fry burger. Like thoroughly with the bacon, with the cheese, with the two patties, with the soft bun action SBA. And it's not even dripping crazy grease. Whew, come on now. Oh, we gotta flip that thing upside down. You know I did. You know, you know, you know I had to. 
Oh my goodness. Ooh. It's so gangsta, I flip it back up. Ooh. Normally I can flip it upside down, still take that bite. I couldn't. Like I couldn't. Uh, can we get that one bite? Can we get it in one bite? Come on. Crush it down. Mm. I like how crispy the bacon is on this one, family. Not that soft limb bacon. The beef, nicely seasoned up. Cheese solidifying everything. Helping it all slide down with ease when it comes to that cheese. Nice little potato bite coming off the french fries. They have a very, very light crisp to them. Less and tomato just kind of there for me at the end of the day to let as well provide a little extra crunch, but I do enjoy the freshness of the bun, how soft it is. I'm sinking my teeth into something, nothing short of magnificent called the J Fry Burger here at Jefferson Fry Company, man. Something that you need to get into. This thing right here is heavy. You better bring your appetite because this bad boy is heavy. It's going down though, facts. Mm. Mm. I almost forgot the cookie butter shake. I messed around with some of the food. There's so much food happening today. This cookie butter shake. Let's see if it's where it's at. Mmm. Ooh. That's some Biscoff cookies? Some Biscoff cookies got that little coffee flair to them. Coffee flair, little coffee and nutmeg, little cinnamon. <laughs> Little cinnamon in there. Mm. Yeah, that's good. That's good, good fam. Trust that. Creamy. Almost is like a, it's like a holiday shake. It's like Christmas time. How we doing Christmas in February? How we doing Christmas for Valentine's Day? This is that Christmas time shake. This is that cookie butter. I ain't getting much butter, but I'm getting a whole lot of cookie. Mm. Fam, just let you know, and I always keep a, a beam with y'all, man. With a quick shout out to Jefferson Fry Company, reaching out, said, "Dame, stop playing games. You need to come get at us." I said, "All right, Jefferson Fry Company, I'm gonna come get at y'all," and I got at him. And uh, look, the hot dog was nice and spicy. That's what I was checking for. It came through the steak and cheese, dirty fries, great flavor. I was, I was, I was definitely enjoying how you know our ribeye cut was just kind of working with the French fries on that one for just a nice little contrast. And then their J Burger came through it monstrous as it claims to be. Big burger, big bites. Something for you to check out for yourself at the end of the day. It's your boy Dame Drops. I holla.